This is Ohio Fish Rescue. Perfect. What the? Rich stories. We, 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 we had him up to Chicago and when he left, we spent three hours re reflecting on big rich stories. Uh, <laughs> yes. After I left? After you left. We had a very. He talked about me for three hours. <laughs> three hours. And we only stopped because we went to bed. <laughs> yeah, so, so fantastic. So, Ed, what are we going to do here, buddy? What's the so next So, what step? we're going to do first is we're going to bring in those aqua box. We're going to start building those. Let's inside. Bring, it, bring it, exactly. Bring the aqua box inside, snorkel, centipedes, all of our, our, uh, our equipment, basically. So, I think we have a piece of liner. I don't know if we're even going to need it, but I brought some liner. I brought some plumbing. Um, so, some, uh, careful. And things like that. And then I think we're going to have to send somebody maybe over to Home Depot to grab some sandbags for us. So that'll be the first step. We'll start building all that stuff, laying everything out. I got a couple sketches over here so I can explain things a little bit more if anybody needs a little bit more uh, understanding of it. And then we're going to start bringing in that crushed gravel. So there's that pile of the, uh, the, the, the limestone white. out there. So I'm going to start leveling this off to get rid of some of those slopes and angles. So really Home Depot about. is important because you want the sandbags. Sandbags in place. What exactly. are the sandbags doing? The sandbags, uh, so normally when, during construction, we're going to come in and we're going to excavate everything out. So we have soil, we're digging down, we're carving into the soil to, to install all of the plumbing filters. Nice flat surface. So, so, we, so this is going to, the gravel basically is going to be that, uh, it's going to create that material that we could actually dig into, but the gravel is going to want to move on us. It's going to slide. So the sandbags are actually going to create a solid structure for us, so it'll create like a trench. So I need to create a trench on the bottom. We're clearly not going to cut into the bottom. We would cause trouble, mess, leaks, etc. So we're going to build up inside of this. And the only reason that we're doing that is when Rich told me this was 12 feet deep. So when, when I first came here and looked at this when it was full of water, there is no way I, I, I could not realize that it was this deep. It didn't so, look deep. No, it did not at all. <laughs> I was going to say six feet or so. It's really a... a, a, a a visual trick. So what we're going to do is fill that in. No, exactly. So we'll build up along that bottom. That's what that first layer of gravel is going to do for us. Okay. All right. So. All right. We carried in the aqua blocks and we're starting. They're building. Fast at work. He's coming flat and they have to build them into cubes like so and it ends up looking like that. This is how 90% of the workplace accidents happen. <laughs> Years I've been cleaning dirt out of this pool. Do <laughs> <laughs> you know how many years I've been cleaning dirt out of this pool and now I'm throwing dirt in it? <laughs> Probably not too often that you put gravel into a swimming pool. Right. <laughs> Look at these guys working away. Well, not this guy, this guy's playing. <laughs> Look at that, back breaking work. Uh, 
Let me take you outside and show you the work going on out there. <sighs> Much different than Key West, huh? <laughs> we got these ramps. Come on. I didn't mean to. Sorry. <laughs> now, we're coming in this door. Past all this rock. There's more of their filtration here. We got the ditch witch coming up from the front, bringing all the gravel. Oh no, that's ingenious. Comes two bucks at the same time. That's that's ingenious. And these poor guys are hauling in the <laughs> gravel. That ain't too bad. Not too bad? That's good. We have pump faults, we have pumps, we have check valves, we have biological filters, we have snorkels, we have centipedes, no pipe. <laughs> so it just didn't make it in the delivery. I have no idea. I don't even have an answer, but we don't have any two inch pipe, so we need to figure out and get some two inch pipe out there. All right, flexible so. pipe, not, I, I mean, we can get by with some rigid stuff because we are indoors, so we don't have to worry about freeze thaws, um, but I would prefer to use flex people. Does anybody have two inch flex pipe? Inch and a half. Sold. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take it. <laughs> okay, so so do we have to go get some, or are we just going to convert it to inch and a half? I think we're going to have to get. So Tony, how long would it take to get inch and a half? Okay, there's somebody there that can drive it up here. An hour, if not, meet her on there, coming back two hours. Oof. So we can go. We can work with inch and a half. So what I'm going to need now is probably 15, 20 feet of rigid inch and a half or two inch and then we could adapt rigid. to it. so we're going to Home Depot. Rigid, we'll just do stubs coming up and we'll tie into it later. So we'll easily be able to get two inch then, but we only have inch and a half anyway. So we can do inch and a half. Okay, so we're converting to inch and a half. Okay, fantastic. Let's get an Uber driver and we'll have an Uber driver deliver it up. <laughs> Next stage is almost done. Okay, this is some of the filtration, caskets, pumps, power heads, pumps, fittings, walls. There's all kinds of stuff here. Boxes and boxes and boxes full of stuff. 
Baskets. Rock lid. I don't know. There's all kinds of stuff here. We are getting this done. Drop a box. Look at Tracy over here. She's been working all morning, running and running. Hi. hi. <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> oh, you used to be in front of the camera. <laughs> YouTube stuff. Oh, she's going to be. Yeah. As soon as I put the camera on it, she went off. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you got all these to carry yet? I, I got another pair of coveralls. You want them? I hope you have right. <laughs> oh, this is going down. Let's go out here and see. Okay, this is someone's car. Now we've got from down there. I can't even see, I can't see the reflection. There we go. From down there, starts there, comes all the way through. All the way down, down the street. And we're all people that are here. And then next we've got this pile of gravel. Let me zoom out, there we go. Oh, come on. This pile of gravel, this pile, and this pile is for the filtration. We're gonna start sweeping up all this and getting this here pulled forward out of the grass. Oh, it's cold out here, these poor guys. All right, they're starting in the aqua blocks now. Okay, now we've got the aqua blocks going down, sitting on top of all that rock. Now we're starting with the large rock. Awesome. These two things here we need. Okay, now they got the Aqua Blocks all covered with the thick gravel. They're leveling that out. Nice. That's the first layer. That's going to be the tube right there sticking up. There's the three twos. Here you go, Terry. Hi. Hi. <laughs> oh my god. We got room pulls. Is that new or is that...